Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Dishonored. This is part two. Hope you all enjoy. Let's get going. This is the Hound Pits pub. Closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. So this is six months after the Emperor, the Empress, was to meet Admiral Havelock was killed. The, Warriors. the Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. We'll see. Okay, let's get going. You go and meet Avril Admiral Hammerlock. Is that his name? Doesn't he say his name? But he's in here anyway. So it's starting at last, Admiral. Let's we'll see what he says. He's found our man. Even after six months in Cold Ridge Prison, he slipped out like it was nothing. Yes. Not surprising. He was the personal bodyguard of the Empress. You've heard the stories. Yes, I have. It still amazes me that someone could get to the Empress and young Lady Emily. No one knows the real story, Trevor. We all have our suspicions. We'll know the truth in time. He's strong and quick. But I hope he understands subtlety as well. This isn't one of your fancy dress parties. The reality is that we need men killed. Have you ever killed a man? Only with my wish. But it's a fair point, as always. He'll be here soon, and I'm looking forward to meeting him. And here he is! We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. What were you the talking about the there? Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Like Until me? the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going Hell to come Lane. out with you. We've been building a coalition of loyalty aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big okay. plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. Did you we can discuss this, this further me? after you've recovered. Before I go but before here. you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Okay. Yes, Piero is sure much an artist for the technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him and then get some sleep. Okay. We can talk more when you've rested. Good to have you with us, Corvo. Nothing again. Right, cool. Let's get it going. Now we're going to look and find everything that we can find because it's fun. <laughs> Obviously. When it stops being fun, we'll stop doing it. But they practice that, don't they? When he gets here, I'll say this. And then you say that. Aye, and then you say this. <laughs> Bit of over 20 coins, so it's Piero's around here. This is still kinda tutorial. Let's I'll be crafting okay. your weapons what and gear. About? All custom work for you. I will create the tools of a master assassin. Now the tank of whale oil is running. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. Sitting we'll for six stay. months, just basically getting when, when Corvo gets here, we'll say this. Minutes. 
Right, we need to go up here and get some whale oil to fix that machine. Whale oil's whale, whale oil is like uh, basically their fuel. Sokolov no longer has the upper hand of supplies of whale oil, blah 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 blah. Not important. You can read it if you want, there you go. I'm not gonna read it. That was probably a bit quick actually, I'll go slow through the books. There we go. I know you're probably not gonna read it, but just if you Abby, wanted to. Is that absurd idea that the energy in whale oil arises from the need to maintain life functions at extreme ocean depths? The pressure in the cold are too much to endure without it. I speculate that a human being might, by a process of adaptation, produce high energy humors in the body. I could build a tank that would slowly increase pressure on a subject over a long period of time and then observe them for years if need be to see if the formulation of energetic substances develop. Surely the Empress would be able to furnish me with facilities subject to the necessary legal amnesty. So he wants to practice and find out if he can make humans and a electricity or power. Piero here. Perfect. Now plug it in. But he fixes stuff for us, so just get it. It's cool by me. Magnetism. Perfect. Thank you, Carl. No sweat. Here, see? The assassin's mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. If you just Hold still, fit must be precise. There. Okay. Can you see normally? About. Lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. Okay, where have you go? Upgrades. Zoom optics. And... Eh, we do want another one. What, what, what is it? Crossbow accuracy. We want that. The crossbow is good. You must be exhausted. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Oh, well, but not yet. Very well. You know best. Let me know if you need anything more. Oh, well. Good man. He had the most monotone voice I've ever heard in my life. So we need to go and see if we can find anything else lying around. In this building. Any monies? River traffic is forbidden from landing in the distillery district due to risk of infectious contact. Violators will be taken to the flooded district for treatment and rehab. My, you must be Corvo. I am Lydia, at your service. Your room is upstairs and ready. Cool. When they talk. Hey, go back. As well. Thought you'd be older, like the Admiral. Well, get out of the way. Unfortunately, I'm only five. Oh, there's a book if you want to read it. It's a Harpooner song. I would sing it, but I don't feel like singing it. <laughs> yes, very much so, but no need to fear. He is here to work with our masters. People say he killed the Empress. Of course he didn't. People are foolish and believe whatever they're told. Okay. If the Admiral trusts him, then so will I. Okay, so who's Wallace? Please follow me to your quarters. Nope. The Admiral served in the Navy under the Empress. But something happened with the Lord Regent that drove the Admiral out. If I understand it right. Admiral Havelock made it very clear that we aren't to carry lamps outside. 
Right, okay. This is Pendleton's room. Go into say. Pleased to meet you, Master Corvo. I saw you at court in happier days. But you might not remember. I was once a close ally to the Lord Regent, Hiram Burroughs. Back when he was just the spy master. He's one manipulative bastard, I can tell you that. Has he? My furnishings have been installed at last with no small amount of complaining by that antiquated boatman. The others have no idea what it's like to suffer as I have. Speaking of which... Wallace! Please breathe two bottles of Dunwall Red, never mind which, and fetch a clean glass. <sighs> well... Such a hard life. Tomorrow. Only got two slaves. This is a uh, Havelock room. Some whale oil. Could be doing with some. There's a book if you want to read it. I'll go a bit slow. There's too many books. I don't think you want to read them. So I mean, I think that will be the last time that. <laughs> I even slow down for them. I will Martin's read everyone in case it's got goodies in it. It seems we've moved to a new phase. Martin's improvisations have borne fruit. The former bodyguard has been freed and is en route to the staging location. The Pendleton's voting block and my military connections. All we've lacked is the ability to project lethal force in a controlled manner against a previously inaccessible... Do not attempt to house or... Ah, to the point, or family we need a man who can kill the bastards for us. Corvo is more than capable of that, I have no the doubt. Only way to help them Enlo. ...is to bring them to the city wall. This all. They will be taken to the flood Switch. district for Switch treatment. Switch. Switch the hell of them. Heels has... It has been days since our man... We'll dispatch to stash weapons for Corvo and the old sewer. Blah, 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 blah. If you just quickly open it and close it, it will tell you what it says if it's important in your notes. So, Corvo's room is up here. On the top floor. Top dancer. This is your room. Get out it was it. chosen to give you privacy. Hey, go. I understand you'll need your rest. Go. There's a couple of things we want to pick up before we um, sleep. And one of them is out here. Attention Dunwall citizens. Be advised the river crust infestation has spread downriver as far as the river mouth and flooded district. Do not attempt to approach or destroy a river crust. Any items recovered from doing so are considered state property. And that's us. Let's do this now. Sleep. Disappeared. This is where you get your powers from the outsider. Hello, Corvo. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you and drawn you into the void. I am the outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that we call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Nice one. Come find me. Cool. So this is Blink. It's like a teleport. You cannot save her, there's a Empress. There's the... He looks a bit like Pendleton, doesn't he? Look at him. 
And there's Emily. What's this say? Corvo, I am very sad. They say that you're dead like mother, but I'm going to put this note in a bottle and throw it into the river because I do not believe them. Living here is very strange. I do not like it, so please come for me if you can. Cool. Mana. There's a spy master. Robots, they come in here later. I think they're called tall boys. So blanks are extremely useful in this game. And the most used power. As you can imagine. In the days that follow, your trials will be great. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another room. Okay, so this heart points you in the direction of runes and bone charms, which are runes you use to upgrade your powers, and bone charms are small boosts that you get. You can have a few on at a time, I think, seven or something, at the most. chance. Take this. Mana. There's the rune. are going to take dark vision because it allows you to see through walls and who doesn't like to see through walls there you go press LT to see in the dark and to reveal living thing living beings through solid walls you can also see their fields of view as well as a visual representation of the sounds you make and on level 2 you see more stuff but level How one's use a really what I have one. given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest. Cool. So there's a lot of bone charms in this room. And uh, these give you room for an extra bone charm, the artifacts. I'm quite sure. Ooh. We'll collect all of them and then we'll pick what ones we want. Five hundred gold. What does this say? Field survey notes, the royal spy. This is the fourth day, month of high code, blah blah blah. Okay, lot of shit. Bone charms, so what do we want? Less noise when we break glass. We'll take it. Swim slightly faster, drop assassination gives you health, enemies miss you when they shoot at you more often, 
win sword versus sword contests more frequently. White rats can be consumed for mana. Definitely give us that. Power effects slightly improved. Nice. Okay, okay. Decent. So we're a bit stronger. So we've got 2,400. Let's go and see Piero. He should have some stuff. Havelock stopped him. What can I do for you? What have you got? A rune for 500? Yes. Any upgrades that I would want? Crossbow range? Yes. Crossbow reload? Yes. Sword crossing? We'll take that. That's all we can afford right now. Let's take a couple of these. Spring razors? The landmines? We take one rewire too, just so I've got one. Just so it's an option. We've got a key to his workshop, and I think that's about it. There is another rune in this area that we are going to go and collect. It's over here. Go for a quick swim. Get this. That's there. To me, and then get coming back. There's a fish here. It will attack you. See, it's getting me. Okay, so now we have to go and speak to Admiral Havelock. Must not be able to get in there yet. Um, is there any food line around in here? He's up. Thank you. What do you say? Oh, that pile of wood out there? It's a hobble he built from an old rowboat. Where does Admiral Havelock find these people, I wonder? Who's seen that? I had a sailor for a boyfriend once. He thought he'd strike gold digging in the Pandisian cliffs. They found his ship drifting empty. Attention, Dunwall. Mm, poor him. River traffic is forbidden from life. Well, let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business. But sometimes, good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Sounds good. Tonight, High Overseer Campbell dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. I've got magic your pills. exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. I've got magic powers. I Another think thing. I can do it. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us, and if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the help pits. I'll grab him for you, don't worry. Is there any more food lying around? We don't need it, so there's no point in looking. 
Uh, let's go and speak to Pendleton. I've never actually went back to see what, if Pendleton's got anything to say at this point. This is his room. Where is he? Are you a nobleman, Corvo? No one seems to know much about you. I've got magic powers. I can teleport. So you need to know. There he's at. That's not. Why are you using here? Is he still talking even though I've left? Is that Attention, not? citizens of Dunwall. The old port district has been added to the evacuation list. The Weaver count for the seats has increased. Lord Reed has decreed that plague ordinances will remain in effect through the month of rain. Stay alert and stay loyal. Oh, well, he must not be here. He must be doing something else. Oh, Cor Corvo. Hello. I'm Callista. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer. That wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me. But my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison. And I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Could try. Before you became an assassin. I'll do my best. Can't promise anything. You know, I tried to attend services with the overseers for a while. That GI. Yeah, just gotten more and more. Money. Right, uh, I'm away already. I'm all the way over here. Seeing if there's anything else lying around before we leave here. Oh, a lot door. Attention, Dunwall citizens. River traffic is forbidden from landing in the distillery district due to risk of infectious contact. Violators will be taken to Locked. the flooded district for treatment and rehabilitation. So save some day, save two people, kill one. Well guys, that's all for this episode. I hope you've all enjoyed. I'll see you next time.